know, I've heard that there's another update. I've got feelings for the RC controller itself. And I thought what I'll do first, I'll just check on the RC first. Good way of checking, guys. It's about putting on the drone. So once it loads up, first thing you always got to check to make sure that your controller is uh, locked into your internet. Usually they, it's turned off, so we just check the internet first. So the way you do that, you just scroll that down. So internet's on, so it's connected to the internet, which is good. So we go into connection, camera view. Now I haven't put the drone on yet. Three dots in the corner, about, check for updates. Right, it says update. So I'm gonna do the update now. It's just, it just loads it up. All right, and it's telling you it's the RC controller. So we just download it. Right, so I'm going to turn on the aircraft now. So the update's been done and it's just telling you there that it's been installed. So you can just click off that, he says. Okay, so what we can do now, we just go, go fly. So I'm just gonna check, cause I'm in the basement at the moment, so you're not gonna get anything there. So there's the new firmware update. Um, so you've got the RC, and we just check uh, the app, which is 1.69. Uh, what I always do then is just go back just to make sure nothing's been changed there, the brakes still on, good. Uh, all my other settings are normal. Control. Yeah, because sometimes they, every now and again, it does seem to change the settings. Uh, what that ends, I don't know. Anyway, so everything's ready now. Uh, I'll be going out for a, a test flight later on in the day, and but I'm going to put up the video of this part anyway. As always, guys, very much for watching. If you've got any questions, add them below in the uh, description. Not description, in the comment section. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next video, guys. Thank <music> you.